Well, anyway, so this is Lysia's Distillery. It's a local distillery out of Cumming. Um, really what separates us, we have something called Quantum Purity Technology, where we mechanically break down your fuel soils, like your methanol, your butanol, so that gives you a harsh bite, and leave it in your spirit. So. Little fruit. Which one are you trying? The single barrel? Did you yeah, single a lot barrel. Of people are That's RSVP? The... You don't try that one as well? Which one, the single barrel? I actually have the single barrel. Um, so do I. I just want to try it. I haven't opened it yet. <laughs> have you tried it? I have not tried it. Well, then try now. some. Well, I don't have that one. Can I try that one, the one I don't have? This one? Yeah. Yes. Mm. This is going to be the 100 double barrel. This one is going to definitely have a lot of barrel Oops, notes. Oops, sorry. Jeez. This one's definitely going to have a lot of barrel notes. Kind of like, uh, it's a uh, rye, yeah, yeah. okay. rye forward. Definitely rye forward. A little bitey finish. Good long beard. finish. That's yeah. nice. That's, that's a rye thing, I think, though. Yes. So, so our favorite one is the yeah come on south side. <laughs> I, I can't believe like how good we that love one it. is. And we when love we go it. to other stores too, everybody always points out that bottle to us, and we're like, yeah, it's just crazy. That's not bad at all. Very good. Where do yeah. we? I got a trash can over here. Um, and also too, I mean, Thanks. they have them very. It's very affordable here. He has a single barrel at fifty five, fifty five. Um, then he also has the one hundred double at uh, forty four ninety nine. So honestly, that's the other one I need to try. Is the 100? Yes. Yeah, let's try that. Yeah, I gotta Wait, give which that one a did sip. I just try? The 100. You tried the 100. The one I'm about wow. to sip. Um, that was pretty good. Yeah, come on. Can I try that one as well? Uh, the 100. Yes, please. Okay, that's which more what I'm used brand? to in a bourbon. That's the the mash bill's got to be more uh, less rye. Which one are you drinking? This is the 100. Uh, the. Oh yeah, right here, double one hundred. Yeah, that, oh that. Okay, that's one I just had. Yeah, it was way way more oaky than I was expecting it to be. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, cool. 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 So it tastes yeah. older than it is. Yeah. Tastes what? Older than it is. What's the age for? About four and a half. Yeah, that's about. Uh, yeah. About right. Yeah. I mean, I guessed it. So it's <laughs> about where I'd, th I'd place it. That's smooth. That's nice. Uh, the black. Label yeah, that's not bad at all. Than the single sure. barrel. That's not bad at all. That's really good. This I is like it. More of the That's more what I'm used to in a yeah. bourbon. Yes. Yeah. This is more of the, I think you said that tannic note, this blue one. I, I like the black one better. Yeah. yeah. I think that's just the rye that you're, yeah, you're the tasting. One, the black one's been selling like hotcakes today. Yeah, uh, that's nice. We sold eight bottles so far of the black one alone, so pretty good. That is cool. nice. Very good. I don't think I have that one. How much is the black one? Uh, he has it at forty four ninety nine, and that's honestly, deal. that's as cheap as I've seen it anywhere. Me too. Yeah, I'm thinking it's usually about fifty five. Fifty five to sixty. Yep. So, because um, we try to get to a lot of places. This is the double one hundred. We usually try to get some of course. to get around like forty nine ninety nine or something, but um, yeah, Thomas has really good prices on this. So. Yeah. So I also have. What's the other one I have? The weeded, uh, the weeded 115 proof. Oh, yeah, that's nice. One. We yeah. actually put that up against Weller and it did yep. well. <laughs> yeah, because yeah. we always do it against uh, Weller full proof. Full proof. I wish I could find a bottle. Yeah. <laughs> I, the weeded one that you guys have Thanks. surprised me with how sweet it was. Yeah. You may have one. Because mm. I, I don't know if you've ever explored his selection over there. Oh, we will. So we we, we definitely will. Haul here. We did a we flight the other day. Doing and he one blinded me today. on everything, and <laughs> yes. he put top shelf stuff. We, and he put, we do one right yeah, now come on in there, this. and it held its We're own. Here. I was well, really yeah. surprised. <laughs> I'm, you know, because I want a yeah, come on. I may grab this just for me. Coming yeah. soon, we are going to be doing a malted bourbon. Ooh, interesting. Malted bourbon. Usually, yeah. that's not my alley, but I'd like to give it a try. I'm too. Um, I'm kind of curious too. Um, Barley's not my bag normally, but we'll see. Because I don't even know, I've never tried anything like it, so I don't know if this can be more a like a malted Irish bourbon. Whiskey. That is a bit weird. Yeah, it's kind of riding the line. Because mm -hmm. I don't know yeah. if this going to be more of like a Irish whiskey kind of Right, right. To That's what it, you think of. Or, I'm, I, I don't know. Hmm. So, be good. We're excited for it, see what happens. Um, How yeah, you guys definitely going to grab this for? bottle. Uh, we started three days before the most shut down of COVID. Okay. Wow. So, yeah, I read that on your stuff. website. Read yeah, that on your website. we've been meaning to come. Do you guys do like... Uh, tours at your distillery. Yeah, we do we've tours been in and come by. Like and that. Um, we do tours. Um, and you have a tasting room too, right? Yes. Sir. Yeah, I noticed cool that on your website room. too. We uh, usually have uh, food trucks on the weekends. Oh, um, nice. We gotta go. Yeah, it's pretty cool and everything. <laughs> uh, we should definitely hit it up. Jokes and everything is like um, kids and dogs are friendly. Just please keep your kids on leash. Dogs are allowed to roam free. <laughs> nice. Yeah. We like dogs Got better it. than people too. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. So. Okay, nice. recommend like a certain day to come down and check it out? Usually I recommend, uh, 
Saturdays are probably more fun, yeah. especially during like the um, early evening. Yeah. Just because that's what's real music chill. and stuff. I, I saw you have some bands playing and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Are you guys still solely in Georgia? Do you guys expand out? We did launch for Chattanooga. Okay. Um, we are Ooh, launching nice. for Cookful, uh, I believe, next week. Uh, so cool. we're kind of slowly around Tennessee, we're working, trying to get with some different control yeah. states. Um, we're trying to get like Louisiana. Mm -hmm. Are those tougher? Sorry? Are those states tougher? The ones that you have to deal with ABC stores or, or state run stores? Yes, because they have to approve you. Right, that's so what I figured. So they have to bring you in. It would be more of, instead of a distributor picking stuff, it would have to be something where it's almost like requested. Oh, I see, I see. So. Huh, interesting. What's that approval process like? Is it like, hey, uh, what is it going to take? take it? No, write I'm a letter, sure wait two years, probably. Yeah. I'm not 110% sure, yeah. but I'm probably yeah. something along with that. Yeah, so. that's yeah, what I'd so, guess. So we review like a lot of bourbons and stuff, yeah. and we're consistently Especially putting Georgia. legends. Yes. And what we, what I always say, at least, is legends continues to impress me. Yeah, yeah this um, one yeah, really They really hold their own. Every time, it is unbelievable. For a newer distillery, too. I mean, yeah. you, you're going up against people that have been around hundreds of years. Yeah. Well, we would love to uh, even bring y'all down and everything, um, take care of y'all. Even yeah, if y'all want to do like a review or video over at the distillery. Yeah. Okay. So when we first um, tested the Yeah, Come On, Chaz said that he would like to see what y'all could do with something a bit older yes. and a bit higher proof. So that was the first one I found that was older and so higher proof. Yeah, I want to taste yep. that one now. Too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, totally. Because I like this, uh, this one. You know what's really interesting the is... Right notes, too. I went back to... Uh, I went back to the Yeah, Come On. So I'm on my third bottle now of Yeah, Come On. Um, and I went back to it recently. Second, yeah. And I got a weird, like, bacon bit note on it that I had never smelled before. It was a little savory so note? Weird. Yeah. A little savory yeah. note? Yeah. Could have been stroking out, but... Um, <laughs> You're going to think I'm crazy. Right. Uh, but, yeah, that one, I, I was well, so surprised yeah, at how good... Yeah, this one had a... A great buttery note right This off one's nice. I'm, yeah, I'm definitely yeah. going to enjoy that. This is going to be a sipper. Thing is too, all of our stuff, yeah. um, I think most of it is very affordable. Yeah. Um, I mean, oh, yeah. Our most expensive one is just going to be our weeded. Um, Why is that? I would, all weeded ones are just always so much more expensive. I really don't know. Maybe the grain yeah. price is up for Maybe. wheat. Yeah. Maybe. You know? It's probably because we do, obviously right now we do source. Uh, we do get our stuff from MGP. It's just we do our secondary distillate. Right, we thought so. Um, do our secondary distillate through our bottle purity. Um, but, so I'm sure a lot to it's do It's probably with just the price of the barrel. distillate, yeah. Exactly. Makes sense. So there's one thing that's popped up. I'm a big fan of Evan Williams 1783. Okay. That's a great mixer. Yeah. They just, I saw a commercial for a 1783 small batch limited something. Or okay. That. We've got to try so, to find it. Okay. All right. So let's try to find it. What is the name of the store? So we're at Village Spirits. Village Spirits, yep. Village Spirits. Village Spirits, Flower Branch. We have not been here before. No. Looks like they have a pretty decent selection. Well, here, here's a cool little bottle. What it is, is so big. I'm in the way. Sorry. Blended Georgia Canadian whiskey with a. Well, what is that? Like one one Canadian flag on it? No, that's a Georgia flag. Rice. Oh yeah, look at that. All right. Georgia Select. That looks like half Canadian, half Georgia. It's Georgian. Georgian. <laughs> it's Canorgia. Oh, this is like the Canadian. This is the this is a whole Canadian yeah. whiskey section. So you're you're standing with the. This is rye right here. This is rye. Oh, uh, they got the redwood rye. Ten high. Um, Daniel was mentioned in this this bottle. God, it's so hard to like make sure the thing is pointing out the right thing. Old Elk. Okay, guy was mentioned in this rye a while ago. Yeah, I remember that. So that, the single barrel is a rye front. That didn't taste as like bitter to me. As um, no, it's got a good hot rye note, but it wasn't yeah. bitter. It wasn't bitter. Long finish. I liked it. Yeah. Oh look, guys, look. What do you got? The rye conic. Is that the chocolate? No, it's, it's not. It's so good. But I bet they've got, if they have that one, I bet they have. They probably uh, do have the chocolate, one. yeah. Seems like the flavored oh, ones are back here. Yeah, I don't know where the flavored whiskey we section will be. So the Russell's it's Six. I don't think I've seen the, the Russell's Rise Six before. The Senator? You want to get the Senator, Brandon? The Senator. Oh, Rare rye. Whatever it smells like, it's not going to be the truth. We definitely need to do That's a right. rye episode. Yeah, 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 exactly. Sorry about yeah. that, guys. Sorry, guys. I, I shouldn't talk, huh? It's fine. Everybody. They got a ton of the granddaddy mims down there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's my guy right there. <laughs> 
They got Georgia. What is that? They got the peach. Look, there's the peach Granddaddy Mims shows. I can't see what the other one is next to it. It says Georgia. There's a zero percent chance I'm bending down that far. That's original. Is that original? That's and original. Peach. peach, and then you got this uh, peanut butter chocolate, which is never gonna. That ain't gonna happen. <laughs> oh look, look, look! This is this is Sounds who's, good, this is who's <laughs> replacing. Um, uh, Cal, um, yes. Oh, really? oh my God! Why can't we Lord, remember? It? I don't know. I just totally blanked. Um, oh, Belmead. Belmead. Thank you. Yeah. So. I wonder if this is the even Bruzel is, is all over the old Dalmi bottles. I know. So this is, is the replacement. I don't know if that specifically is a replacement, but this is the company that's replacing. Yep. Oh. The Nelson Brothers. Yeah, because Reed. somebody was saying we need to. What was that? Uh, the video of that guy that I saw. Bruzel. Bruzel. Yeah. Go grab a. So I had some of this the other day at a buddy's house, and it was quite good. They have another 1910 here. I might grab that. I'm almost out of 1910. Gosh. Right. Yes, I know. The turkey. <laughs> Got me a bottle of that. Got to have a bottle of turkey. So have we done the smoke wagon? Nope. Not yet. Not yet. Not Saved yet. it for you, Chaz. It's Saved on, it for you, buddy. It's on the to-do list. In fact, in our, uh, in our bottle we'd like to try next in the last episode, that was my bottle I'd like to try next. Okay, this looks like more we're getting into the flavored whiskeys. Yeah, but oh, at the bottom oh, shop. Brandon, early times. Come on. You know you want, you want me to get down there? there? Seriously, Come I'm so on. fat, Matt. Come now, on. now, listen. Oh. I just want you to know that the blue wrapper. They're all blue. Yeah, yeah I, oh. I didn't finish my sentence. The blue wrap. You have to look oh. on the very tippy top. The blue I know. It wraps over. around the black cap. Yeah. There's no way you looked at all of them. I did. There's no blacks in there. You can check. That's number one. Double check me, man. That's just this his way of saying you do it. Crap that I <laughs> do it. No, no. Seriously, I did. I look. Oh, right. Now you gotta check. Ugh. That's fine. That's fine. So there's no way you could see that. Oh yes, can't there, you can't that. see back there. There's only like they're only like four deep. Yeah. Oh, there's a black cap. You lie. Yeah, I'm just lying. Oh, is that the one to get? <laughs> yeah, they're the older juice. They're supposed to be very good. That Bernheim is still. I still want to find that. The, the uh, single barrel barrel shrimp. You're not in the right place to find that. You gotta go look behind glass or something. Mm -hmm. well, they had it on the damn shelf at Jack's, man. Yeah, but it was on like their secret shelf. <laughs> <laughs> that is kind of true. Their secret shelf. Secret shelf of good. So I got what I'm going to. Uh, All right, what'd you get, Chad? 1783 small, small batch. batch. Okay, is that the one you were talking about? This is the one I'm talking about. All right, something cool, new. Cool, cool. Sorry, Shane. Yeah, I know. Is that a try? It's, Definitely not at the uh, upper God, level. We try some all folks. shelves, man. We try <laughs> all shelves. Just See, my wife guess. would buy this one just because it had a really want that cigar blend. Bad sweater on it. What is that? Wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> bad. Hang on. What is this? Bad sweater. Brown sugar and holiday spice flavored whiskey. Yes. Tastes like Christmas. Tastes oh, like Christmas. My God. <laughs> Should we buy that and save it for Christmas? Yeesh. Your call on that. It'll probably still be here at Christmas. I have never seen this this King's uh, Family Distillery version. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's just their bourbon. <sighs> yeah, I thought that I had their straight bourbon already. Maybe I'm wrong. Interesting. Hey, look, Doc Swinson's. Yeah, well, we can't talk can't about it. Can't say, talk about this it. This is still... It's great, isn't it? Yeah. It's one of my favorite just, ones. Is that the double oaked? The double oaked. Nice yeah. stuff. It's a good one. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of, you know, we're still... What do you got? You know, really at the beginning oh, level of... Oh, there they are, dude. Sampling everything, but but it's, you know, it's fun. I it's getting, a picture. Did you take a picture? It's getting good. It's, it's, uh, you posted it on the group chat. Uh, the release number 230004. Yeah, so that's it. So we can talk about it now. I guess it's out. So what's... And the third one was the other one I liked. Brazilian Amberana. That's the one, right? Right. This one right here. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. delicious. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. that man got pappies. Oh, this. What are yeah. you doing? <laughs> what is this? Oh, hold on. I got to no, I got a chip drink. Yeah, it's sure drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's just no bottle. Good uh, for you. Yeah, we can drink, yeah. Enjoy them. This is oh, yeah. I'll, 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 yeah. This one is almost uh, empty. Yeah, I, I would, a new bottle here. If I was empty and a pappy, I would cry. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. Very good. That's yeah. a great yes. bottle. Did yes. you just get these? Yes, we just got them in. Yes, yes. Yeah. I just this morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. there you go. Yeah, so we, we had a... We tasted uh, them kind of before we were supposed uh -huh. to. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, oh, yeah. And we haven't been able to talk about them until now. So now, now I know we can talk about limited. them. Very yeah. limited. Yeah. 
You yeah. only send me a six pack or like twelve bottles. That's yeah. it. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that Amberana is yeah, yeah. really mm -hmm. good. Yep. Interesting. All right. Do you have any like special bottles laying around anywhere we can yeah. look at? That you aren't know, that, that aren't priced like Pappy? <laughs> oh, did you say special bottles? Where are they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. How far? I'll follow you. I gotta follow him. That Amberana bottom, that is amazing. Really oh, you got a whole wall over here. Excuse me, guys. <laughs> Pardon me, y'all. Okay. <laughs> Half gallon, oh, wow, they got the 175 of Buffalo. Wow. Yeah, I got one. Wow. Okay, well, we're going to spend some time yes. right here. These are all scotches. Here, Do you have a cigar blend? Right here. Joseph he Magnus. does have a Magnus cigar. Oh, yeah. oh my God. Hey, on top of it, we have oh, the you, old yeah. Yeah. cigar blend. Yeah, the cigar. I've been looking for that one, too. Yeah, right yep. But that's the king. Uh, 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 that's the uh, Joseph Magnus king. That's the one. I took a bottom last night. That thing is so much fruit for Oh my gosh. Why do these have names on them? What's the story? Oh, these are that? my personal bottles. Oh. I think, yeah, there you go. Oh, See okay. all those wellers yeah. that I want? Yeah. Those yeah. Are his. Does this make sense? Oh, that's a good choice. That's Eagle Rail. Oh, yeah. Benchmark. I mean, that An Eagle and a Benchmark? Oh, yeah. bucks alone. Um, you got a mixer and a sipper. Yeah, yeah. this is for yeah. everybody who yeah. complains yeah. about. That Benchmark yeah. is a straight up sipper, dude. It's like it's nine not, bucks. It's not fine. But the Eagle Rail is good stuff. Yeah. Wow. Oh boy. Uh, that man is mean uh, just carrying around Pappy. Oh, dude, if you want to just buy Eagle Rare. Yeah, no, I was just noticing. But that's what it. I'm saying. Like, Eagle Rare is like 42 bucks of that pack. So yeah. That's interesting. They also have a Buffalo Trace on a bench. Wow. Huh. That Buffalo oh, yeah, Trace basket, how much do you want for that? Yeah, yeah it's, it's a good deal. 42 as well. That's, that's a really good price on that. Oh, here's the single. Uh, it's probably older or just very rare. rare. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they'll have batches of distillate they? or mm -hmm. ages that are rare that they only have a little bit of and they put it out a little at a time. Yeah, I'm going crazy. Hey! Get it, man! You're, you're not done yet? Or you're I done? bought an extra bottle. Yeah. Bought <laughs> it, they're only 30 bucks, dude. Yeah. Well, it's th 35, 35. With, with the purchase of another barrel. Or oh, bottle, to, excuse me. To, oh, but no, I don't have to check for cigars. Anyways. I am wow, this mesmerized awesome. by his wall of goodness. Well, this is a great place to come and uh, shop around. And a great Those wall. are all his personal bottles. That's his That's stash nice. that he drinks so with folks he likes. No a lot. white dog. That's right. That's right. Yep. So now I'm drinking. Uh, I'm drinking cigar blend. The cigar blend. Yeah, mm. I got a bottle at home. If that was a hundred bucks cheaper, I might think about it. Mm. <laughs> uh, he's got the rare stash. That's what Daniel was talking about. Remember, he's talking about rare at the, the Magnus Rare Stash. Oh, that's two bottles. Oh, that's not bad. These are so hard to find. That they are. I see. Okay, so buy one, you get the price on the other one. Yeah, I get you. I get you. Yep. Ah, the Guero. We just tried that. The oh, 14, yeah. right? Guero. 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 It's a two guy. It means a two guys. Those are the David Finney and uh, <laughs> the uh, uh, Jordan Valle, the distillery owner and the master distillery. Oh, no way. Yep. Good to know. Oh, wow, man, that's a hard one. That's actually kind of smart marketing. I won't sell that unless you buy this. But I have it. That's the thing. <laughs> Do you hear my wife talking? Do you, I put a ring on that. Do you hear that? My unemployed ass <laughs> thinking about a four hundred dollar bottle of whiskey. Yeah, right. Absolutely. I can't justify a four hundred dollar purchase. I love Nicole's idea that we go and buy stuff that flies going by. Do we that? need to talk that through. There are issues with it. Why? No, you might buy the same thing. No, you know. We'll go together. And we record I'm just gonna record this whole freaking yeah. wall, dude. Are you good with recording slow. yourselves? Oh, this is crazy. Is happy. Oh, there's the lock, stock, and barrel, y'all. Let's just put behind glass, and other stores just put on the shelf. Like, you saw okay. that, that lock, stock, and barrel 21 just sitting on the shelf. Do you think it's ignorance? No, I just think it's no, what different think, people value. I think it's the area. Oh, it could be that, too. I didn't think yeah. of that. That larceny barrel proof might yeah, be worth 74 is. bucks so right the there. That it's all the same weller. He's just got it behind glass because everybody asks for it. Can Do you want to know how he has this many wellers? He probably has been around a really long time and has good relationships with the people that have allocated, specifically Buffalo Trace. He seems to have a ton of Buffalo Trace products. Hey, there's that Calumet 16. Nice. 
Oh, yeah, do you have to get another? Yes, let me show you. Oh, it's right. I don't know. I don't think that there's going to be much of a haul, to be honest. Unless Matt decides to go crazy, but he just spent a bunch I mean, of money. Are you kidding so. me? I've got like four bottles so far, and I'm still going. Yeah, <laughs> yeah mm -hmm. but there's nothing like there's nothing like these. Oh, oh, you're not aware. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I'll I'll pull if it off. I picked on that a bottle for you. Knowing the ones that I've tried so far. Benchmark number eight, ten ninety nine. No, I've got Honestly, probably already. something else from it, Remus or something else that's a higher proof from no, Buffalo Trace because you yeah. really like the stag. <laughs> like that Weller full proof or the Weller 12, I'm really trying to find that. I haven't even seen a stag here, actually. Nope, I haven't either. Whenever you uh, ever come back, mm -hmm. I recommend it. Okay. I got a bottle myself. Wow, this is like ridiculously hard to record this. I'll have to try that. Yeah, with the glass reflection, that's tough. Well, just like walking in that. general. Yeah, right. this is all my... Hey, buddy! Grab these two also. <laughs> You're getting them? Yeah. I've never seen a cigar blend. I, I came back for more. No. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, so here we are at a post-haul summary. Yeah. Uh, who wants to go first? Chaz. Yeah, I'll go Chaz? first. All right. Chaz, welcome so, back. Yeah, thanks. All right. It's been a moment. So what I got, what I was really on. mostly interested in was getting this Evan Williams 1783 small batch. The 1783 is a great mixer. It helped me through a lot of rough times. <laughs> As whiskey does. <laughs> As whiskey does. So I wanted to try this... Uh, expertly crafted small batch special blend and so hang on so you've had the regular just not the small batch uh this is something new okay i've never had uh this just the regular like i said it's you're gonna share right of absolutely all right absolutely new so from 1783 or new to you new to me i know i think it's actually new from evan williams 1783 okay. small batch so okay. we're gonna try that all eventually. right cool awesome and everybody's favorite on this channel the yeah come on uh, from Legends, thank you, Garen, Darren, yeah, for uh, letting us stop by and, and, and sample some of the stuff. So I had to get a bottle for myself. This is probably going to be or shortly becoming my go-to daily bourbon sip. This bottle continues to win so many people over, and I am on my third bottle. It punches above its weight uh, every it's, time. It's behind Brandon. It, I, in fact, I'm on my last bottle. I should have just grabbed one over there today. Yeah. I didn't even think of it, but... That was a little, a little rough for me today. It was uh, a long day, y'all. It was a long yeah. day. Yeah. All right. I guess I'll start. Um, go ahead. You want me to start or you? No, nah, let me go. You have, you have, you? You have, you have right. the grand go finale. Ahead. You have the okay. grand finale. All right. Go ahead. All right. You want me to, do you want me to show them, show them the prize? one by one. You can do whatever you want to do. Anyway. All right. So I'm going to start out with my pick from Legends Distillery, which is the uh, 100 bourbon, which was a great taste, and it made me want to buy it immediately. So I picked up a bottle. Big shout out to Garen and, and to Legends Distillery for uh, letting us uh, shoot some footage and also for offering to yeah. perhaps have us up to their distillery for a bit of a tour Which and maybe a yeah. collaboration a little bit. So we're really looking forward to that. Then... This was, by the way, we tasted this. I don't know if you mentioned that. Oh, yeah. Um, delicious. Yeah. It, th this yeah is, very good. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, and then there's the, uh, the, uh, the prize for me of the day is the Joseph Magnus. I have not had this yet. This is the straight. And uh, and my 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 find of the day, stuttering. everyone. I'm stuttering. I never thought I would own this. <laughs> never thought I would own a bottle. Yeah. Joseph Magnus cigar blend, the one everyone's looking for, and it might be one of the last ones in my state. So uh, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, big shout out to uh, uh, the gentleman who helped us out. Help me out with his name again. Thomas. 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 Big shout out. Village Spirits. Thomas was a, a great help. Great selection, has some really nice bottles to choose from. Awesome if, bottle. If you guys have been following along on our bourbon hunt journey, if you haven't, I've got a playlist under the playlist section where you can watch them all. But whenever I see the Joseph section, I always look in there and I always yeah. make the comment, yep. I wonder if somebody accidentally put a cigar blend in there. <laughs> I've been looking for this forever too. So. Woo! All right. So that was my haul and I'm That's super it. happy with it. All right. Um, dun, dun, dun. I also got the Legends 100. I'll just stick it behind here. Uh, this one, I have not heard of this. So, snagged Beardstown. Beardstown. I don't know anything about this, actually. Age, aged in... Oh, I thought I said aged in American, like they misspelled it, but there's over here. <laughs> aged in American. All right. Uh, looks interesting. Try that out. Uh, I was dangerously low on 1910. Yep. So, you got another? So, 
I Matt's have, new favorite, Old Forester. Yeah, thanks to the blind taste test. I'm now replacing, I'm replacing my 1910 bottle. Uh, picked up another Weller, because why not? Uh, what else did you was, get, Matt? It was there. <laughs> uh, got this for the wifey. But really, it's called Bushwhacker. You picked up the rum? Bushwhacker. Oh, my God. Coconut rum, rum cream. Oh, I, really I grabbed one, too, for the wife. So. Tastes like a, got one it tastes like a Mounds bar. <laughs> Yeah, I thought it was okay. Good. Yeah, Very yeah, good. Nice okay. and chilled. Uh, all right, Let's we are this. running out of space here. Let me, let me scoot these Move my back. babies. Ah. Um, this, this is interesting. was recommended by Garen mm-hmm. at Legends uh, Spirits. I've never seen a Penelope barrel pick before. And then um, Thomas came and told us that this was his pick. Yes. Yeah, so, so 115 proof. Does it say the aged four, four and a half years? 42% corn, 26% rye, 32% wheat, batch number 30. This is a pri- private select from mm. Village Spirits. That guy had like the hookup of stuff. He there. did. They have a lot of connections there I, at Village I've, Spirits. I've, in fact, he, Chaz held this up to me, and I was like, oh, I got the whole Penelope blend. And then I looked at it and was like, wait a minute. <laughs> private yeah, select? Then, <laughs> then he came and started letting us know about it. Um, and then I also got the, is this one different than yours? It is. Oh, this is the Murray the Hill. The Murray Club. Hill. Got that. As That's well. a big deal, by the way. Don't sell and that short. And I also got the cigar Joseph blend. Joseph Magnus cigar blend. As well. So we were totally out of room on this table. It was a big haul day. But there you go. That's our haul summary. And we're going to go smoke a cigar now, I think. Absolutely. So Absolutely. thanks for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, let us know. Our socials are in the comments below or in the description below. Uh, let us know what you'd like to see next, what you like, what you don't like. Let us know. Yeah. That's it. All right. Cheers, guys. Cheers. On the next one.